No species of cordyceps has been observed to infect humans yet. No species of cordyceps has been observed to infect humans yet. Not all cordyceps species are bad. Not all cordyceps species are bad. Cordyceps might know what species they are infecting and act accordingly. Cordyceps might know what species they are infecting and act accordingly. Experiments involving this fungus sound like they were designed by mad scientists. A fungus spreads through a host's body until it bursts. Even creatures who aren't zombified are in for a horrific time. Cordyceps works its way through the entire body of the host, eventually forcing itself out in a gruesome display. Once out in the open, the spores are free to spread to freely from host to host. It may be disturbing, but Cordyceps has developed a unique and efficient method of reproduction. Insect suicide is often the end goal. For any ant that falls prey to this deadly fungus, the results are rarely pleasant. After its brain is hijacked, chemical impulses drive it to crawl up the nearest blade of grass. The fungus then forces the ant to clamp down on the grass before killing it. The high vantage point allows for the optimum dispersal of the cordyceps spores. This way, the wind can carry the spores over a vast distance and infect countless more ants. Cordyceps essentially hacks an insect's brain to enslave it. Cordyceps essentially hacks an insect's brain to enslave it. Each species of cordyceps specializes in a specific host. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below. And also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.